This resolution, among others, we are taking at the plenary following debate on a motion presented on the floor by Senator representing Delta North, Ned Nwoko. In his lead debate, Senator Nwoko expressed concern over the kidnapping incident in Galadimawa area of Abuja, where 19 people were forcefully taken from their homes, including his senior legislative aide, Barrister Chris Ajidi. He further noted that out of the 19 individuals kidnapped, 12 have feared that while efforts to ascertain the well-being of the remaining seven victims are ongoing. Worried that the recent abduction of 19 individuals, yes, 19, including my senior legislative aide, Barista Chris Agidi, in the Galadima neighborhood, Abuja, exemplifies the gravity of the situation. Despite swift engagement with law enforcement agencies, tragically, according to security forces, out of the 19 abducted, 12 lives have been lost. And seven individuals are still being held captive in a forested area spanning approximately 100 kilometers. Contributing to the debate, Senators Ayinaya Abaribe and the Adamu Alero noted that the rate of insecurity situation in Abuja is alarming as most people can no longer sleep in their homes for fear of being attacked. So many citizens no longer sleep in their homes. They run into town and go back during the day. So there's something very, very serious going on in around the federal capital territory. No matter what we say, this is the capital territory of Nigeria. If there's anywhere that's going to be seen as very secure, this ought to be the most secure place in Nigeria. Now that it seems that uh, the same lackadaisical attitude to security is being taken to, all of us are at risk. No time for us to revisit that issue of uh, 500 million naira worth of contract for the installation of CCTV camera in FCT. We have to make the contractor to account for that huge sums of money. The citizens are left without security. The money has gone down the drain and nobody is talking about it. I'm happy that uh, Senator Monir has brought out this motion. We should support it and in mandating the committee that will do the investigation, they must thoroughly investigate that contract award. The Senate leadership therefore called on the Inspector General of Police, Kayode Egbetokun, to increase patrol around the FCT and other parts of the country to curb the worriness trend. Messi Adams reporting for BTV News.